I'm trying to breathe, I'm sinking underwater, but I try to escape. I've been drowning, the speed gets stronger, and I'm not quite ready to break. I'm trying to breathe, I'm sinking underwater, but I try to escape. I've been drowning, the speed gets stronger, and I'm not quite ready to break.
Yo, 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 everybody, welcome along. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. Hope you're doing very well today. Uh, my name is Simulation Fallen Nation, and we're going to go back to the West Coast today for a little bit of fun. But before we do that, let's say hello to everybody we have here. So, good afternoon to this gamer guy, Calm Donnelly, Jen Greenwood, Adam, hello, welcome to you all. Alex, Nathaniel, welcome along. Louis, we've got Fiat 110. 90 for life, hello. Gold plays is here as well. JSH, Caroline's here. Welcome everyone, how are we all doing? Tyler's along here as well. Golgo13, Eli, Sim Gaming, uh, Gab80. Wow, there's a lot of us in here today. How are we all doing, folks? Hope I haven't missed anybody there. Ashton, Nathaniel, Paul's here as well. Hi, Paul, how's it going? And I think that's everyone. Welcome along, guys. How are we all doing? Hope you're all having a lovely Tuesday. And we'll go and get into some uh, a little bit of fun again, shall we? Oh, no, oh, first things first. Every time it likes to do this. Just to be annoying. There we go. Alright there, guys. What's up, Jamie? Welcome along to the stream. How are you doing? Can you do more contracting videos with BF? We are, Tyler. We will be doing... We'll be back this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, as usual. So do keep an eye out for that one. Uh, but we are, like I say, we're back on the west coast today, and uh, we're in the Valtra, uh, the T-Series Valtra, I think this is the 374. Uh, and for the first time, I'm using the Chrome Ultima, and I've got two bells there. So this is kind of cool. I'm doing very well, thank you, Alex, and Nathaniel, very well today. Uh, having a great day so far, got a few things ticked off the list this morning. And um, we're looking to continue. Let's just make sure that that volume isn't too high. That's too good. Yeah, the hell. I'm gonna put cruise control set up. Put it back. You can still see my taskbar now. But it doesn't look like it's coming through on the stream. Oh, thank you, Ashton. Oh, bear that in mind. Oh, no, we can't. It's gone. Perfect. Oh, I'm reading the stream too much. Uh, I do like yours in the Ashton perspective. Oh, perfect. Oh, excellent here. Thank you very much, Tyler. Yeah, we like to try, for Cornbrook particularly, we like to try and mix it up a little bit, make it a bit different. Uh, there's a lot of different things we can do, different aspects we can work on, so we always like to play about with that. Uh, no, this baler is just from the mod hub. This was a separate um, mod. No connection to the straw add-on at all, but it is a very detailed mod. This has been around for ages, but it's the first time I've got, used, got down to actually working with it, which is quite something. Uh, regards to T7, I think if we get any T7, it would likely be the similar shape to the model we had on demonstration. Um, but yeah, that's still kind of be, to be confirmed yet, so I'll have to wait and see. What's up, Chris? Welcome along. How are the guests? Are they still there? Oh, that's a loud rapper. That bail wrapper is super loud. What we're going to do, we're going to take off the headlines of this field, of that field. And are there any on that one? That one's been done. We're going to round bail these and then we're going to mow the rest of the grass down for hay. And uh, got a nice little setup ready to go on with that as well. So what has everybody been getting up to today? What are we doing this evening? Are we jumping back onto onto Farm Simulator? Are we heading over to Lone Oak? Or where, what are we working on right now? I thought I'd take a little bit of a break from Lone Oak. I've been on there for quite a long, uh, long time, to be honest. I've streamed it for about a week solid now, so... A rest is as good as a... Or a change is as good as a rest, as they say. Do I do multiplayer at all? Not really, Ashton, no. Um, I am thinking about possibly doing it. 
I might see if I can get onto a uh, simulate stream uh, server one of these days and have a play on that. Good to hear, Paul. Which thumbnail changed? Oh, Goggle, you're on Green River, that's awesome. I've never actually played on Green River. You've been on the forest fire? Sounds intense, Nora. How did that happen? Oh, excellent work, Alex. Congratulations. Are you back out in the fields now? Uh, excellent. Good to hear. How are you finding that? Are you enjoying being able to drive a tractor now? Or drive a tractor legally? I'm not sure, uh, Army. I don't know when that changed. Oh god, we've got rolling bells. You stop there. Stop. Stop. There we go. That rapper is very loud. Thunderstorm. Oh wow. Like a lightning strike set that off, maybe? my favorite mod that isn't a map? Um, that is a great question. I really like uh, the... Ooh. I love uh, Matt XJS's classic pack and also his T-dubs. I think they're fantastic. I really, really like some of the new uh, Fence 1050 mods that are out and about. Some of those mods are really good. Um, other than that... Oh, I don't know what else to have to think about that. Yeah, we had some here actually as well, Paul. I woke up at about, must have been about 4 a.m. to flashes of light in my room. It was quite weird. And then couldn't get back to sleep because the dog was snoring, which was a delight. Hello, Ian. Welcome along, buddy. How are you doing today? I haven't spoken to you in ages. Gravity. Hello, Kian. Welcome along. How are you doing today? Nice to have you on board. How is your Tuesday coming along? <laughs> you know, yeah, Adam. We uh, we're flowing back over. We're we're coming back into the West Coast for a little bit. A map that I still love. I've recorded another episode of The Young Farmer today, so that will be coming out tomorrow on the West Coast, which is all good fun. Uh, November 20th, it'll be here before we know it as well. That's the great thing. It'll be uh, fantastic. And with every day that passes, it seems like uh, List Town confirms something new, a new feature somewhere. And um, they are. They are fantastic, I really cannot wait. Uh, Fox, I don't think so. Uh, 
Uh, I'm not too sure about that. He may have, but I don't think he did. I'll have to look back at some of his videos. The snore, I can't, I can't even begin to imagine what it's like. Oh! Oh, I see Ian. Okay. Well, you need to have it replaced anyway. Hey James, what's going on? I have, uh, I just got this today actually. Because uh, I knew you might be around, so I thought I'd bring a bouncer into the West Coast series, if not low enough. And it kind of looks quite nice on the this side, prone. What have you missed? Hello Dagwin, fan FS17. Uh, not too much, we started about uh, 11 minutes ago, so we bailed the headlands off one field. We'll bail in these headlands, and then we're going to mow some more grass, tend some grass, and make some hay. Uh, we're going to be doing square bail hay. Yeah, I try and get into streams. Eli will always jump in and around. Uh, worked out quite nicely yesterday that when I finished, Tim jumped on, so I uh, had a little bit of time to come in, say hello. The T series wouldn't quite pull this, I don't think. It's a little bit too small. So to go for the, this is like 374 horsepower, and that crone requires quite a whack. I can still see my taskbar. There we go. Shakes a lot. I don't know what the beta occasion shakes like crazy. I don't know if it's when the uh, the raffle starts, but it's uh, it's a loud machine as well. No worries, Dagwin fan. No problem at all. What's up, DS? Welcome along to the stream, my friend. How are you doing today? Goblin up here, then. Absolutely munching for it. Let's put it wide a little bit. What's up, CD? Welcome along. When am I finishing? I will be finishing just before Landy comes in around uh, 7 pm, so an hour and 17 minutes away. in real life and it just doesn't seem this big but um, it still takes a heck of a lot of power I think. Alex if I had a tractor to lend you I'd get in touch but uh, sadly I don't anymore. I think it really does. I don't have any slurrying to do at the moment, unfortunately, James. Maybe when we get to that stage, we might go back for again. But we'll have to see. Yeah, this is a nice little matchup. Very much enjoying this. And I love how it has a continuous chamber, so you can still bail whilst you're on the move. I think that's really impressive. Although it does shake the beta when the record starts. Do I make maps games? I do not know. Uh, I I make amendments to maps as I play them for a Let's Play series. That's about the extent of it. How much is the straw add-on now? Adam, I don't know. Um, I really don't know. I think it was, a, it, when it was released, it was around, was it around £17 or something? It might be a little bit less than that now, who knows? 20th of November, everyone, is going to be a great day. Strap yourself in for that, it's going to be well worth it. Um, 
try to start the shake. Let's see when this shake starts. Well done. Okay. Hello, Mr. Bullet Bill. How are you doing, my friend? Welcome back into chat. I trust that all is good with yourself. If you do put my name on the top of the voucher, that's a lot of work, James, but we'll see. Maybe one day. Oh, yeah, no, that was a really good one, actually, Ian. I remember that. I need to uh, pre-order FS19 today. I need to get onto that. That's uh, a must, I think. I assume, would it arrive faster through like Amazon pre-order or will Steam do like a pre-order and we get it at the same time? I don't know what to expect there. Ooh, Bill, I was going to ask. Has the weather permitted any more harvest at Cold Park Farm yet? Or is it uh, a lump of hit and miss at the moment? to get one of those, get one for me as well, that'd be nice. PS4 through Amazon? Oh, nice work. And there's that shake again. All of the small little features that we're being told about now are all sounding more and more fantastic. I'll be very intrigued to see how Gearbox works on consoles. I'd love to see what the key binding will be for that. Just waiting on the oil seed rope. Well, that sounds good though. At least the barley's all in the shed. There's so many of these bales going to end up in a hedge. Stop. Stop. and gently around that corner there. Lovely stuff. This is the last headland we're going to do. The field on the other side, those two trees there, is going to be hay. So we need to ped that one out. And as will all of the main body of these fields here. So we've got that. That's a good idea, Dagwin's fan. I might have a look into that, actually. It's on my list of uh, jobs to do today, so we'll see. We need that. That'll be really good to hear. Did I just go through and destroy all the bales I've just made? Alright, so. We're gonna go back up to the yard. We'll go this way. Oh. We also have a pit of silage that we need to uh, clamp, so I might set the JCB away on course play for that one, just leave it be. Because uh, that needs to be all rolled down, compacted nicely, and then we can hopefully get that sealed in. Whoa, 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 whoa. you just stop. I don't mind waiting like an extra month or 
which is pretty much about a month. It usually came out in October, so I can wait an extra month, six weeks or whatever for a good quality finished product. I don't mind that at all. If they're going to make all of these little changes, then that is perfectly fine with me. Uh, let's stick this on the other side for now. Oh, 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 that's gone disastrously. Unfortunately, there's just no real way to escape having to muck out cows. There are a lot worse jobs out there, I find. A lot worse. Okay, we'll leave it there for now. So yeah, first job, we'll just get the JCB away, we'll get that clamp in the pit. Making sure everything looks good in there. the biggest heap of silage ever in the world, but it'll do. I'm just gonna take a smooth this out a little bit so we can climb up the thing. No worries, have a good rest of your day and I'll speak to you in a bit. Alright then, so like I say, we're just going to get this in a position that the, in theory the JCB can just clamp it itself with the Ada course play. JCB, climb up the hill. You got this. Come on, come on. Oh, I'm stuck. What am I in? How do you mean, Nathaniel? This is a JCB load all if that's what you mean. Stuck on a ledge there. We will come back to that. We might need to free that up. Uh, so I think we will use this. Don't think I need a front weight on here for the uh, for the tether, so we'll lower that down. No worries, Dagwin fan. Catch you later. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, Callum. Yeah, I had a little bit of time to uh, kill today, so I thought, why not? We'll jump into a stream, see what mischief we can get ourselves into. Turns out quite a bit. Um, and a few things stuck already and crashing quite a bit. So, uh, another day. Not close enough. Try that. Try that.
let's not forget the toaster though, Ian. The all important toaster. Uh, so, which field are we going to first? I believe it's one over here. That one? No, it's the one. I think I can go through here and get to the one I want. There we go. Some cruise control down for the better kind of speed, I think. Awesome source. Let's get this done then, I suppose. This tractor is a case 5150 um, Maxim, I think it is. Uh, but this is the pro version. This is available through Matt's Classic DLC, uh, Matt XJS. The other tractor we had the bailer on was a Valtra. Um, was that the, uh, the T-Series? T-174 I think it is? I completely agree with you there Paul, it is fantastic, I absolutely love that map. I really still enjoy making all my uh, Let's Plays on that map, it's absolutely incredible. Really quite something. Everyone get up to for the rest of the day. Do let us know that in the comments there. And how many people in the chat here are currently working on a like a game save on a, on a frontier design map? So either West Coast here, Lone Oak, um, Oakfield perhaps, or even maybe Cobra Park Farm. What are we all working on out of that list? Uh, Eli, we have no John Deere's on this map. No, this is a. Uh, for once, a bit of a John Deere free zone at the moment. I have quite a few John Deere's on low notes, so I thought I'd keep them out of this map. I also need to think about collecting silage bales, but I think that can be a job for another day. Adam, you're on Cold Park Farm. Awesome. I cannot wait to see if uh, Bullet Bill gets around to making an FS19 version. <laughs> Stefan81, welcome to Simulation Ford Nation. Thank you ever so much for subscribing, my friend. Hope you do enjoy your stay. We've got 38 people in here, don't forget, if you haven't done already, please do hit that like button. Uh, it really does mean a lot for me and for the stream, and feel free if you'd like to share the stream with anyone, you're more than welcome to do that as well. And if you've yet to as well, do hit that subscribe button, join Simulation for the Nation, and come and join the family, uh, see what we get up to. And if you are a member of Discord, you can also come and join our Discord server, keep up to date with everything that's going on. It's very much worth it. A lot of chat at the moment across all the Discord servers about uh, everything FS19 related. Hey Kian, welcome along. How are you doing today? Welcome up. So I have uh, a very nice tractor waiting to bail this up attached to a Pretty cool looking baler, so we'll be in, once we get these done, it'll be nice to go and pick that beast up from the store. Um, it's even, it's a slightly different version to one that's out there, it's got a straight pipe on it, and it sounds fantastic. I'm playing CPF DWC, okay. 
That's a nice plan, Ian. I like that. I have taken a little breather from Lone Oak, uh, from Oakfield, beg your pardon, so I will be... I feel like I'm approaching being ready to go back onto there. Uh, a lot of people have been asking about it as well, so I'll have to make a, a reappearance on that map soon. Who's looking forward to seeing Shamrock Valley in its entirety? Uh, Oxygen David's latest map does truly look something special. The more I see about that, the more it just looks incredible. I've got a nice little, well, hopefully a good idea for that. I did hear about that, Kian. Yeah, that's fantastic news. I'm very intrigued to see how that works for uh, for PlayStation or for consoles. I'd love to see if they have like a manual gearbox, how they how the keybinds work for that, because a lot of the configuration is already taken up. Sixty two sixty k downloads. That's awesome, man. That's really good. That's the version that. Um, that we've had for a while, is that right? I think it's the same one. The version that was on a certain server, let's say that. So I think what we'll do, we'll get the, we have a rake man who will come in here and rake all this so we don't have to. Uh, just to save the effort really. So we'll finish tending this out, probably take only a few more minutes given how far we're through it. Uh, and then we'll go and collect the new tractor to work on this. Quite possibly Eli, yeah, that might work. That might work. Like For me, I use the PlayStation controller and I already... I've got like various different um, configuration setups. So like various different button presses mean if you press certain buttons with the bumper buttons it together, it produces a different result, so it's going to be quite difficult to see how they do it, but very interesting nonetheless. I do like this old little case. What a lovely tractor. Pink sky as well. I forgot it's evening. Yeah, get some hay bales before it gets too damp. Awesome news, Dagwin. Welcome back. I'm delighted to say it's about five or six degrees cooler where I live today than it was yesterday, so I am in a much more pleasant state of mind. That was unbearable yesterday. I did, Eli. Yeah, that's another lovely little touch. Really nice. I wonder if it's the same for levers, because that'd be pretty awesome. It's like when you raise the hydraulics up if one of the, the levers moves with it. Maybe two, three passes left. Set the rake up. Go and fetch a bailer. Ideal. Oh, someone just messaged me on Discord. Yeah, I like the fact that they're really putting a lot of detail into in cab. So a lot of things like the animation, I think, is great. I don't know how easy or hard that would be to program across for uh, any mod machines, but if it's possible, it would look fantastic.
Oh really Eli, there you go. Oh. 20 degrees in Durham, Paul, oh lord. Did I get stuck on that? It was a lot warmer than 20 degrees when I went to bed last night, it was just miserably warm. But I shouldn't complain, because when it gets into the winter again over here it'll be like negative 20, so... Gotta make do with what you can. I'm gonna close my Discord down as well, just to stop making any more noises. Oh, CD, I, we're having the same weather, I think. Uh, it's not as bad now as it was yesterday, but oh, just brutal. Too much at times. I like the idea of the 3D garage. I like the idea of the way, from what I read, they're going to be grouping machinery into kind of uh, category size, which I think is awesome. It's like horsepower grouping. I think that could be really cool. 72 in Wisconsin. 72 is not too bad. What, what have you got stuck on? There we go. SB Agri, welcome along. How are you doing today, buddy? Welcome into the stream. Alrighty, done. So we will park this up. We're not going to need this for a while. The next thing we'll need this for is once we've mowed the rest of the fields down, which uh, we obviously still haven't done yet. That's not a problem. We'll get the old Massey in. That can go into the. That's still on the rake. We'll get that working on course plate, and then, like I say, we'll go and take a little trip. Do you know what, Ian? I think you're right. I think we only know like this, uh, the very fine, small details. I reckon it could still be something pretty big that perhaps wasn't quite ready at FarmCon, maybe. I'm very interested to see more about the place falls as well. Just see how that works and building your own farm. I think that sounds sounds very interesting and could potentially be awesome. I'd love to see it though. Massey somewhere as well. Where is that? Hmm. I couldn't afford to. <laughs> well, it would be lovely to think one year if maybe Farmcom would come over to uh, either UK or uh, maybe a bit closer to the UK. France would be pretty cool. Alright then, so... Uh, we are in field 24. Thing. 
So we're just gonna quickly hop on over to the store where we have our new Baylor and Tractor waiting for us. It's behind me here. There we go. We've gone for the 180-90, which I'm sure will please many people, but this one, um, thanks to a friend of mine, has got a straight pipe. So this is gonna be quite a brutal one, and it sounds awesome. Michael, welcome along to the stream. How are you doing? I'm doing awesome. Thank you for asking. Very good. Got the one pet one eighty ninety back. Sounding fierce as well. Absolutely lovely. With of course forty modern uh, the New Holland D one thousand on the back here, which I've yet to actually use. So I'm looking forward to this. One knows I keep meaning to get around to using, but never, never really did. It's going very well, Lone Oak, thank you. Yeah, it's, uh, Lone Oak is still fantastic. I'm really enjoying it. I thought we'd take a little bit of a break today, come back over to the West Coast. Got to catch up there, because I have been on Lone Oak for the past five or six streams on the spin, so. Uh, got a little change of scenery. Still a lovely scenery, it must be said. Use some, uh, slightly more classic equipment over here. And fewer John Deere's, because uh, my lower oak is all John Deere. Yeah, sometimes the Ian family or real life gets in the way of, of desires and ambitions, I guess. Look at this thing. Get up that hill. Hey Michael, welcome along, how you doing my friend? We used to have one of these once, but I can barely remember it. When I started to go out and work on the farm a lot more, we traded this in for a Ford. Well, not a 11090, actually, not a 180. Where we traded it in for a Ford, so I missed it for the most part. Hey, Killer, welcome along, how are you doing? I don't actually have that uh, enabled on this game at the moment, to be honest. That's kind of why I had to go for this one. But, uh, I might have a look at that. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with the case for a new Holland. I do like those a lot, actually. Really nice uh, machines. I've more new Holland than case mine, I would say, but... Yeah. Love them both equally. Shame for Luke, you won't do. Hello, Jameson Manley. Welcome along. How are you doing today? Welcome into the stream. Hope you're having a great Tuesday so far. Catch you later, Eli. Thank you very much for stopping by and hope you do enjoy today's video on Lono. Hello, Galcom Gamer. Welcome along. How are you today? Thanks for stopping by again. CJ Contracting as well. Hello. How are you doing? Yeah, I might have a little bit in there for.
Oh jeez, it is. No, I don't think many people would know that at all. It's amazing what you can do as the collective. And everyone kind of pulls in the same direction. I think it's great to see. Three hours of exams. Oh, that sounds terrible. Get a Renault. Oh, there's an idea. I had a Renault actually uh, that I tried. I thought it was okay. Nothing out. Nothing incredible, but a decent machine. Oh, nice old bell counter there. CD. I like that. Knowledge Lone Oak will be converted across, yes. Uh, I think it's Lone Oak Summer Valley will be converted over when, uh, when the time comes. channel then please do hit subscribe come and join the simulation for the nation you never quite know what fun and mischief we can get ourselves into thank you cj i really appreciate that glad you enjoy it it's really good fun to make actually we are uh, vf and i try and find something different to do each week and try and keep it a bit fresh and have different ideas so it's a challenge but it's always good fun hello lone wolf how you doing haven't seen you in a while. I hope all is well. Good to hear, John. That sounds awesome. What were you doing? What was the farm working question? I can't help but feel that you, sir, parked in the way. Stop. Hello Massive Fergie Boy, welcome along, how are you doing today? How is everyone's Tuesday going for all of you new arrivals? Uh, I've just broken my neck though I think. Just leave this about here for now. Perfect. By the new Holland uh, T series, I think we will. Um, we just going to think about it really, but yeah, it should happen. Why would we? Do it? 
we definitely think it's something that we need. The we like the old TM175 that uh, that Jamie drives around in, but it's kind of a bit old and it's uh, in need of replacement. So we'll likely replace that with the uh, with the new C7, and then I think after that the Massey will keep. And we'll, I think we're going to put some GPS on both actually, so we can get some nice efficiency uh, going. Yeah. A lot of uh, a lot of things to do on Cornbrook still. A lot of uh, a lot of work coming through as well. So it should mean there's plenty of episodes coming up. God, that is a good one, Paul. I just said that. Actually. I've turned up the volume on the, the bass on there. Don't make it louder. Ooh, it did get louder. I love my Massey on Combrock. I think it's awesome. Really nice. I think if we ever do, uh, we might get an increase our fleet size because I don't really want to get rid of that Massey. Catch you later, SB. Thanks very much, buddy. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Jack Presto, thank you ever so much for the donation. That's really appreciated. I'm really pleased to hear that you're enjoying everything, Jack. That's great news. Uh, this weekend, Dagwin, there'll be two. There'll be one on my channel uh, on Sunday. And the next one, or the Saturday's episode, will come out on the F's channel. So one a week, every week. We'd like to do more, but they do take so much organisation um, that it's just not quite feasible, really. Uh, sadly, but... We always try and make it one good one a week, at least. I feel like soon we'll have to come back and do some more second cut silage, because it's getting close to that time. Moving cattle around. Oh, nice! That's great to hear, John. I love livestock work. Except for shear and sheep. I always hated shear and sheep. Never a fun thing to do. Man, shearing sheep on what was always going to be a hot, sticky day was just miserable fun. Well, it wasn't fun, just misery. Uh, I believe he is, Dagwin, yes. I believe usually he'll be up, um, I think it might be around 4, maybe. Uh, let me see. No, it'll be around 3 o'clock if he usually comes on. 3, 3.30. Running through, which will be uh, eight o'clock uh, UK time, and he usually runs through till around anywhere up to about ten o'clock. Catch you later, Ian. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. I'll catch up with you uh, later on, hopefully. But I will. I've got a few things to do beforehand, uh, but I will be hoping to get into VF stream. Just uh, join in with all the chat. the bales. Get out. Uh, I'm 
I'm going to leave that there because we don't need that for now. And then we need to go and find where my other tractors are. I need to find where the uh, Massey's gone because we need to stick some mowers onto that. I fear I may have lost that in a mod switch up. We'll have to see. Thank you, Dagwin fan. It, it is a great series, and I've had a few people asking this week what's happened to it. It's still here. At the moment, it's just had one episode a week. Uh, I think I'm going to dial that back up to two. So it will be coming back so soon, and I hope to be recording an episode tomorrow for Thursday. So keep an eye out for Thursday. All being well, at least. That's when it should arrive. Is the Maxi in there? No. Oh, it's got a lot of JCs. Uh, I wanna... So it's got a lot... Is Dave streaming tomorrow, Adam? Um, I think Dave's not back until Thursday, I think. Do go and check on his Discord, because I may be wrong with that, but I think it's Thursday at the earliest he mentioned to me. Oh, thank you, Jameson. Um, I, I will warn you, my Instagram is something that I'm trying to get back into. I need to spe be a bit more diligent with that. But, uh, yeah, thanks very much for that. Uh, so that's there. Okay. It's not around the back here. Do we have one still? No. We also have two bailers by accident. Which one have we used? That one. Well, it looks like we'll have to use the big voucher then. Let's disconnect that. It's Defo Thursday. Thanks, Paul. So I will be back on my uh, usual, well, this is usually my uh, streaming day tomorrow, Wednesday, uh, and we'll be probably back at the same time around 12.30. Get on uh, whoop. No, 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 you stay there. Thank you, Jamie, I really do appreciate that. I'm really pleased that you like them. May I ask, what is your favorite uh, series? So I always like to know what series everyone likes the most. Tomorrow, for those of you who have yet to see it, we have a new episode of uh, the young farmer arriving tomorrow so do if you haven't seen that uh, do keep an eye out for that one it's quite a cool little series of a young guy who's trying to make it in life as a farmer starting off as a little contractor which is kind of cool Ooh, those blooming barrels England 7910 welcome how are you doing today I hope you're having a great day Dairyman's Diary is your favourite perfect that shall be returning on Thursday as I said so do keep an eye out for that one. We are coming into the depths of winter with Dairyman's Diary, so there's going to be a lot of different, odd, interesting jobs occurring as we just try and get everything, the farm back up to scratch and ready to go. Oh, have I left the indicator on on the feet as well, Robert? Darn it. Catch you later, Michael. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. I'm just going to zoom over. Feet, 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 feet. You are not wrong. Perfect. Hello, Bucko. Welcome along. How are you doing? 
Hope you're doing very well. Maxim 629, Lone Oak is the best. Oh, interesting. I had quite a fun uh, time recording today's Lone Oak episode, I must admit. It's really good fun to use machinery that's completely different to what I'm used to. It's fascinating. You wish the JCV load all come out and, uh, yeah, that'd be awesome if it did. No worries, Michael, that's not a problem at all. I am terrible for leaving lights and indicators on, on my tractors. Really terrible. Okay, so we're gonna knock these two off pretty quickly, and then we can get on. Jump. Oh! This is the best way to do this. Uh, let's say let's go that way. Jack Ping, welcome along to Simulation for the Nation. Thank you for subscribing. Hope you do enjoy your stay. The Valtra came in today, yes. Uh, I wanted to put it onto the big chrome we used at the beginning. Uh, and I thought this was a nice change. I do like a good Valtra now and again. It's a nice little machine. And it looks quite good with the mowers on. And it looks like I've accidentally uninstalled my the two other tractors we had on here. So uh, we need to kind of utilize this for a little bit longer. This is going to swap around. Park Farm, then Lone Oak, then West Coast. Oh, nice! Thank you, Lone Walker. I appreciate that. It's just really nice to, like, the, when you've got such a brilliant map, get out of the way, Bales. When you've got such a brilliant map like, uh, like Lone Oak, with machinery that you're not 100% used to. It's just nice to get in there and push your comfort zone a little bit and have a play. And the, that, that blends itself so well to so many different ideas. It's perfect, really. I would probably say so. We've got a few ideas that we've discussed about of how to extend the uh, Cornbrook and see where it goes. Uh, we are also planning uh, for Frank and Eddie to meet up again later down the line. I've uh, got a few ideas for that one to come into play. Just got past that round bill. No worries, John. Thank you very much for stopping by. Have a great rest of your day and we'll see you shortly. What is my favourite series, Jamie? Um, good question. I, at the moment, it's a toss up between. Um, the Young Farmer series on West Coast and also Lone Oak at the moment. I still really like making Meadow Grove, but uh, I like the the ideas that I have at the moment for the other, the other two. Um, I think they're going to be my, possibly two of my favorites at the moment. I think Cornbrook has some great potential that in the future as well. We've got a few good ideas for that one, so I'll be really excited to see how that pans out. Um, but yeah, I'd say they're my favorites at the moment. GPS makes things a bit easier. 
is Eddie off Cornwall? No, Eddie's still there. No, Eddie is on uh, Ball and Craig uh, VF series. That's where he's from. Sweet old school tractor in the last thumbnail. Uh, the thumbnail for for Lone Oak. Show? Is that the one you mean? Or the the big uh, the big yellow articulated tractor. I can't wait. If that, if that actually happens, it's going to be incredible. Stop, 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 stop. Let's get you down time. Yeah, oh, so that one, uh, the rather... Do you know what, Joe? I can't quite remember. I have to do it. I have to go and dig that out of my file and see. Um, I am hopefully... I've said this quite a lot. Hopefully today I'm going to get uh, the final stages of a low note mod list completed. Because a lot of those mods are a little harder to find than perhaps others. Um, so yeah, that's the current plan. Uh, the version I am using, uh, the Lone Wolf, this version actually was given to me by... I think this is... Let me find out what version I'm using. Uh, I got this version when I did a, a bit of work on the Frontier server, Lone, uh, Lone Wolf, so Ian would probably be the best person to find out where this one came from. A new Holland? Uh, yes, Jamie. I do believe so. Uh, maybe not for this episode. Maybe the one after that, or this weekend's episode. Maybe the ones after that. Cool, come Viaduct. You are absolutely correct. Can't wait for the 20th of November now. Really, not that far off. Look at the sunset there. Isn't that something? It's a little bit skippy in here today, though. How much of this field have we got left to do? Oh, next to none. Oh, 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 oh! Lots of that. I really don't mind waiting the extra kind of four or five weeks from a usual release to get it in uh, November. If, if it means it takes that little bit longer to get everything done, I don't mind that at all. Red Dead 2 the past time. I keep hearing stories about that. Is it is that due to come out at around the same time? The GPS needs to go home, he's drunk. Absolutely. Uh absolutely is Bucko, oh, yep, that's the plan. Gonna make a few more bales of hay off here. We've got this one, the, the one just over the hedge there, and the one we just mowed. So 
We've already made, I think it was 37 bales of hay, something like that. So we've got a few, but we do need a lot more, so this should help us get up to scratch. And then we'll make it, because we are currently in the first day of summer, we'll let this grow a little bit longer. And then we might make some more hay um, towards the back end of the summer as well. Just so we can be sure that we've got enough, because the last thing I want to do is... Oh, 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 go forward. Oh, that's gone terribly. There we go. Can you see this with just the Valtra tractor, please? Possibly. Um, it would have to be a very unique series, so I'd have to think about that. Maybe one day. You never know. You never know. Decide to uh, revert back to the desktop there. That was fun. I thought for a second I just did a VF and pressed Alt F4 somehow, but uh, unfortunately I hadn't. Thank you, Bucko. I like to try and make it sound different, and there's that useless tax bar again. Let me just figure this out here. I like to try and make it rely upon some of my previous experience, let's say that. Uh, uh, in a second there. there we go, we're caught up. Yeah, so I like to try and use previous experience to make a more interesting detailed story. So sometimes it works well, other times it's uh, I have to do a little bit of research for things that I don't know too much about. but. Uh, yeah, I like that. Um, if it makes it all the more interesting. Oh, wrong button. Do you do giveaways? Uh, at the moment, no. Um, I don't have anything to give away at the moment. If I can find something to give away, absolutely will do. I could have possibly bought the butterfly more. Uh, I've already got 74k in the bank though, so I don't want to spend too much money. We just need to, we haven't got a lot left to do this year, so we'll just try and rattle through and get it all done. Catch you later, Jamie. Thank you for stopping by. Hope you've had a great day. And we'll hopefully see you shortly. Uh, England 7910, I have, uh, I use OBS for all my recording needs. I used to use Marillus Action, but I switched over to uh, <coughs> to OBS about three months ago, actually. Right, just a little triangle to do here, which we may just and reverse for that. At one point I think I did have a trailed mower in here, but we took a vote in one stream and went for the uh, this combination. Um, I'm probably not going to change it now because I haven't really got a lot left to do. Uh, might possibly for the next, the next uh, big silage or hay session we do on uh, on the on the west coast here. Hey Blaj, welcome along buddy, how are you doing today? Nice to have you on board. How's your Tuesday been? Can you do a series on Balan Craig? Do you know what I've I'm leaving Balan Craig to VF because I think he's done such a good job on it. Uh, and for me to do a roleplay on there would be, I kind of like, feel like we'll be invading each other's space. He doesn't, uh, he doesn't have one on Oak Meadow Grove, so uh, we kind of, we, we 
jump on and help each other's streams out or help each other's uh, series out but we never really we haven't done our own series if that makes sense so I've chosen to um, to kind of just stick with Meadow Grove and he's chosen to stick with Alan Craig and I think that works quite well besides I don't think I could replicate or emulate what he's done there uh, with Eddie I don't think I can quite make that work it does look like an interesting map to work on though second cut oh lovely stuff how many acres of second cut are you making and how much grass do you have is it how how much rain have you had for your second cut so i know a lot of people are struggling with just lack of rain I need tractor mods, James. Um, I'm always—I wouldn't say I need them. I'm always on the lookout to see what there is. Um, any good mods, I'll always have a—you know—download them and put them into the game and see how they look. What tractors have we here? We have got this Daltra. We have got the Case 5150 Maxim. Uh, at the moment, the Massey 390T. Uh, currently. Oh, and the Fiat 18090. This map, I think I'm going to stay off John Deere's, if only because I got an awful lot of them on uh, on Lone Oak, which we'll come back to tomorrow probably. So I'll probably stay off John Deere's on here for now. But again, if I find a good one, I will always look at it. I did buckle, yeah, the McCormick went uh, for the case, um, and then the Massey that was on here accidentally got removed from the mod file, so I need to re-download that and bring that one back on, because that was a nice little Massey. Oh no 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 come on GPS uh, Around 20 acres in total. Ah oh, not too bad. Not too bad at all. I do have the Massey Black Power and I don't know if I do actually. What size of uh, machine was that? No worries Dagwin. Dagwin fan, have a good rest of your day, enjoy your dinner. Thank you ever so much for stopping by. Imagine in the next few minutes, Landy Kid will be coming up. Uh, he is getting back into the pattern of streaming after his holiday. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. The 
You'll only play with uh, uh, John Deere, Nick. I like that idea. I will be. I cannot wait to see which John Deere's they're bringing in. I really can't. What do you rake with? We have a crone uh, rake here. It is the 9 meter ARM team, uh, modern team crone. So nice and big one. Uh, sufficiently wide enough to kind of rattle through these fields pretty quickly. And that has been pulled by a 390T four wheel drive Massey Ferguson. Does a nice little job. Should have taken one more headland off here. It's just a little bit too narrow to turn around. Never mind. Next time we'll do better. Am I crashing to a tree here? Yes. I do, Robert. That's the current tractor we have on the rake. We just need to finish off, what we need to do first is get all this mode and then tether it all out and then we can uh, then we can get it all raked up. So that's going to be in another stream's time I would imagine. Mm, but we'll just get this little bit in the corner taken care of first. My spring body is coming along very nicely there, good to see. people in here welcome along everyone hope you're doing very well don't forget if you are new to the channel to hit that like button uh, share the stream around as much as you'd like to it really does mean a lot and helps the channel grow and also if you haven't done yet please do hit that subscribe button and join simulation for the nation we always like to see new people join the channel and you never know what you might be missing out on some evasive action here. There's a tree! There we go. Oh, no. Stop it. Stop it. There we go. Oops, one day I had was broken down as much as it was running. Ha! <laughs> That's never fun. It's just getting, it's going on the power trip, Lone Wolf, and then just when you think it's settling back down again, BAM! Another GPS power trip. What John Deere was that, Gav? Chucky 2009? I haven't heard of that channel actually, I'll have to check it out. Hello Aditya, just saw you come in there, welcome along, how are you doing? Hope you're having a great day, so that must be really late for you there today. Two thousand five, sixty-nine, twenty. Yes. Uh, See, so I heard. I never really had a, any experience with those, but I heard they were great tractors until they got to around three thousand hours, uh, where it all fell to pieces. Now I don't know if that's true or not, 
but uh, it might sound it, given what you were saying. Silly uh, JCB still stuck. Oh, nice, Bucko. Hey, Matty311. Uh, my dad had 2003 and it was fine. Oh, that's cool. I wonder what it was then. I'll have to find that. See if I remember who I spoke about that. It might be with a specific gearbox in it, maybe. Uh, but I don't know. Maybe you guys are just all lucky. I never really got to drive a 60, well, a 20 series or a 30 series. I'd love to have. That'd be really awesome. Thank you, James. I really appreciate that. Okay. So I'm just going to check quickly. Plug in. Turn on. Is, can somebody check for me to see if Landy is live? Because he usually comes on around about now. I'd expect him to be on countdown. Uh, in the meantime, we'll park this up and we'll just do a few little odd jobs around here. Same here for now. There we go. What are my cattle doing? Ooh, they need water. They need some water. on here but I feel like that may be missing as well somehow so we need to unfortunately we need to go and get another tanker um, animals think same thing there we go we need one of those because animals are rapidly running out of water so we'll take the Valtra Perhaps a little overpowered for this job, but uh, hey ho. Which music do I play? I play, I fl switch it up, um, but I use pretzel for all my music. Um, so yeah, I, I everything comes through pretzel, so it all kind of varies. But at the moment, I think we're using the happy playlist from pretzel. Oh, 
I think I already answered your question there, Aditya. You can kind of... Pretzel's really good because you can go into it and just... There's a whole load of different playlists. You can make your own playlist if you can't quite find one that suits your needs. Kind of available for everything. Drivers don't like me very much. I've hit a lot of them. Issues which are entirely not my fault, but uh, you know, these things happen. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no, will we get Seasons mod in 19? Uh, it's been confirmed that that will not be in the standard FS19. Um, now, Nothing to say that it might not be called or uh, carried across later, but uh, to begin with, it will not be there. But no, I would imagine that at some point it's going to come through there. I'm very interested to see how the dynamic lighting works, what that looks like as well, just to see how well it's, uh, just to see the difference really, I can't wait. And with the, uh, kind of, I don't know what they exactly call it, but like the dynamic sun and moon as well, to see that actually moving across the sky would be great. That'd be really cool. Oh, understeer. That's a good point, Liam. I don't actually know. I'm not too sure. Welcome to the stream, by the way. I'm not sure if they have confirmed if they will uh, update that. I would assume they would. Uh, I think it would be a bit odd if they didn't, but uh, yeah, that's, I'm not too sure. There we go. Hey, Witchy. Welcome along. How are you doing? Perfect, then. A little bit late, but that works just perfectly for me. Um, we will take this back up to the yard off camera and get those cattle sorted out. But for now, it's going to be a good mode rush and pull over. At this stage, I'd like to say thank you very much for watching. If one of my mods could quickly grab uh, today's Lower Nog video and stick that up onto the stream, that would be awesome. Thank you ever so much for watching everyone, I hope you have enjoyed, I've had a blast as always. We will see you, we'll be back at the same time of uh, 4, 5.30 tomorrow, uh, 5.30 UK time tomorrow, um, and we'll be back on Low Note Farm tomorrow I think. So we will see you then, but until next time I hope you have enjoyed, I may well see you in Landy's stream once I get a few jobs uh, ticked off, and we will see you later, so have a great rest of your Tuesday, and we'll catch you tomorrow.